In this video, I'll show you how to sign documents on your iPhone. If you found this guide useful, then please consider subscribing. And once you've done that, then please consider leaving a like. And let's get right into this guide. Firstly, you need to make sure the document is saved to your iPhone, specifically to the Files app, and I'll show you how. For example, I've got a document in my email which I want to go and sign. So all we need to do is firstly go and save it to our Files app, as I just said. So go and tap on the file, whether that be in your mail app or another app. Then go and tap on the save button in the bottom left. Then this will open up the share menu. And what you need to do is scroll down. And then what you need to do is go and tap on save to files just like this. Then what's going to happen is your files app is going to go and open and you need to go and choose where you want the document to be saved. I'm just going to go and save it in this folder called convert, uh, but you can save it anywhere. Just make sure it's easy to go and find. So tap save like this. So we now need to go to our files app to go and find the document we just saved. So either you can go and search your phone for it by dragging down or just go and look in your app library. But you Usually your files app is going to be on the second page. If you think you may have gone and deleted it, then go and open up the app store and you can just go and search for files and go and re-download it. But in this case, it's on my second page here, so I'm going to go and open it up. Now you need to go and tap on browse in the bottom right like so, and when you first click on browse, you may be on this sort of page here. What you need to do is press on on my iPhone and then go and locate where you just went and saved the document. In this case, I saved it in the convert folder, so I'll tap here and here it is, sign this. So I'm now going to go and tap on it like so, and here is our document. So now to go and sign it, what you need to do is tap in the bottom right on this pen icon like so, and here it is. We've now at the bottom got all these different selections of pens, and you want to go and tap on the pen like so, and then what you can do is go and choose the thickness and sort of the transparency of it as well. I like it on this thin mode. Then what we need to do is go and zoom in a bit because if I sign now, it's going to be huge. So to zoom in, all you need to do is use both your fingers and just pinch like so. If it starts drawing, don't worry, you can always undo that. It just means you put one finger before the other. So I'm now going to go and start writing. So I'm going to go and sign my name now. If you go and make any errors, don't worry, you can always go and press the undo button in the top left like so, and then you can undo it and you can go again. So I'm just going to sign mine with Tucker now. And you may need to go and zoom out again just to move along like so. And when you've done, all you need to do is press done in the top right like so, and that's it. We can now go and open it up again. And as you can see, the signature is now there. And now you probably want to go and send it or just share it with somebody else. So to do that, you just need to go and tap on the share button in the bottom left like so, and then you can go and email it to somebody or go and send it to somebody in a different app. If you guys found this video useful, then please consider subscribing. Peace.